we can most prime here doing a remark on that voice comparison reaction this time for our Baraka. So, full volume and full screen and let's go! Let's do this. Hmm. You usually want to hear a Baraka voice. I usually hear like a monstrous voice because he is a monster, isn't he? This guy does sound a little bit monstrous, so I'll give him a thumbs up. That was a great voice. Baraka. Yes. Definitely. This guy's voice is good. Oh, is that it? What? Yes. Brilliant. Oh, Greg Eagles. Definitely, and that's also a great game, MK10. Stephen Blum's voice from MK11. Yes, that's good too. See, Bum's awesome. Great voice actor. Well, I think his best voice role in MK has to be Sub Zero, definitely. But he is actually really good as Baraka, pretty scary too. Wow, that's, that was a very quick voice comparison, but definitely Steve Blum from MK11, Greg Eagles from MK10. Also, uh, who was the voice from MK9? Yeah, Bob Carter. And also uh, Dan Washington from MK to DC. And also the unknown voice actor. So yeah, those are my favourite voices of Baraka. Wow, they are really good. Okay, so uh, this is me doing a voice comparison reaction for Baraka. So with Baraka, you need a very monstrous kind of voice, really, when you're doing a voice for Baraka. And... Those who I mentioned, they delivered very well. Even Steve Bunce, I didn't expect him to come up as a voice of Baraka because in MK, I've always associated him as a voice of Sub-Zero and also Reptile. But wow, he was awesome as Baraka. And also Greg Eagles. I've also heard him as, as Jax too, but wow, he was also really good as Baraka. Okay, so uh, give us a do a like and uh, let me know in the comments who you like to see voice of, of Baraka, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you all later.